Ever had that sinking feeling when your hard drive crashes or you hear about another data breach? That's when you start wishing your data had its own armored bunker. NordLocker promises to be just that. But is it the fortress it claims to be or just another average cloud locker? Let's dive into the most complete NordLocker review you'll find online. In this video, we'll be looking at what NordLocker has to offer in the form of key features, ease of use, privacy, performance, and pricing. And lastly, we'll take a look at how NordLocker stacks up against our number one cloud service to see just how good it really is. Spoiler alert, there's one particular missing feature that could be a deal breaker for some users. Can you guess what it is? Leave your answers down below. So what is NordLocker? Well, it's a cloud-based file encryption service made by Nord Security, the same folks behind NordVPN, which you've probably heard about. First, let's take a closer look at the storage and standout features that NordLocker brings to the table. NordLocker offers both paid and free storage options. The free plan gives you three gigabytes of space, which is not bad if you only want to encrypt your collection of cat memes and your top secret lasagna recipe. Premium plans can go up to two terabytes for those with more storage needs. First, you've got end-to-end -end encryption, which ensures your files are encrypted client-side before they leave your device, making it impossible for anyone, including NordLocker, to access them. It's an absolute must-have for anyone handling your data, and NordLocker offers end-to-end -end encryption, even with the free plan. Another expected but welcome feature is the ability to easily share files and folders with encryption. This ensures that your shared data remains secure and accessible only to the person it's being sent to. It's also located in Panama, which has decent privacy laws. But here's the first downside, collaborative features. NordLocker's lack of real-time collaborative features could be problematic for some teams or businesses. In the same vein, NordLocker doesn't integrate with third-party productivity tools like Microsoft Office or Google Workspace, limiting its appeal for users seeking an all-in-one solution. Another missing feature is file versioning. File versioning stores past versions of your files, allowing you to restore them completely after a while. It's not the worst issue, but it'll cause a pretty significant inconvenience if you're coming over from a service that does have this. Features are important, but they mean little if the tool isn't easy to use. So how does NordLocker fare when it comes to user experience? Like most other Nord products, NordLocker is designed with simplicity in mind. For a service provider this focused on security, its layout looks great and makes it easy to use with a web client desktop apps, and mobile apps. Features like drag-and-drop encryption make it accessible even to users with little technical experience. Setting up takes just a few minutes. You download the app, create an account, save your cloud key, and then you can start encrypting. Even your grandparents could probably figure it out, assuming they can stop asking why the cloud doesn't look like an actual cloud. Now, of course, the real measure of any encryption tool lies in its privacy and security. So let's see how NordLocker keeps your files safe from those prying eyes. NordLocker has a strong reputation and no history of data breaches or leaks. It also secures your files using cutting-edge encryption technology like AES-256 and XChaCha, both so secure that it would take the most advanced computers available today billions of years to brute force. Additionally, NordLocker has a strict zero-knowledge policy, meaning only you have access to your data. Even the company cannot decrypt your files, which gives you complete peace of mind. But be warned, the no-knowledge policy means that if you lose your cloud password, you cannot get it back, and all your files will be permanently gone. It's a small price to pay for privacy, but I imagine it would be a bit of an inconvenience if you ever forget your password. Moving on to speed and efficiency, transfer speeds depend on a lot of things like your location and your internet service provider, meaning individual user experiences may vary, but based on our in-house speed tests, we found that encrypting and uploading files to the cloud was fast and efficient, with minimal impact on system resources. So, how much are you going to have to pay for all this? NordLocker offers a range of plans, and here's a breakdown of what you get with each one. NordLocker offers three plans, one free plan and two paid ones. The free plan gives you three gigabytes of storage and basic encryption features. You can use it to test out the product and get a feel for it, but it's not really great for much else. The paid plans offer 500 gigabytes and 2 terabytes for $2.99 and $6.99, respectively, both billed annually. These are very competitive prices. In addition to the extra space, you gain access to encrypted file sharing. If NordLocker tickles your fancy, use the link in the description for the best price. Finally, let's see how NordLocker compares to competitors like Google Drive, Dropbox, and our number one cloud service provider, pCloud. 
pCloud is a very strong competitor to NordLocker. Both are heavily privacy-focused and check all the right boxes when it comes to user privacy. Although you need to pay extra to get end-to-end -end encryption on pCloud, it has everything that NordLocker doesn't file versioning, third-party integrations, and even an option for lifetime plans. If you're interested in exploring pCloud, you can use the link in the description to get up to 60% off. While Google Drive offers robust collaboration features and 15 gigabytes of free storage, its privacy profile is abysmal. There is no zero-knowledge encryption, which means Google can always access your files. Kind of like a nosy neighbor. Sure, it lets you store a lot of stuff, but it also loves peeking into your backyard. NordLocker, on the other hand, couldn't care less about what's going on in your garden. Dropbox is similar to Google Drive with amazing collaborative features but very questionable privacy policies, not to mention Dropbox's history of data breaches and leaks. So is NordLocker worth it? With strong encryption, user-friendly features, and reliable performance, it's an excellent choice for anyone looking to secure their files. The pricing is competitive, though the lack of collaboration tools and features may be a drawback for some users. If your priority is data privacy and encryption, NordLocker remains a top-tier option. However, for users needing more extensive storage or team-based features, exploring competitors like our number one provider, pCloud, might be worthwhile. Also check out this video where we compare all the best cloud storage providers.